The debate continues in Washington over a possible second round of individual stimulus payments to American workers. But a new scam is popping up even before lawmakers decide whether a new check will be coming. Consumer investigator Hank Winchester shows you how the scammers are trying to get you. Millions have already received the money, the stimulus check that is helping many during these difficult financial times. Discussions underway in D.C. right now regarding a possible second check. And just the talk alone, enough for scammers to make a move. Here's financial expert Tom Hakeem. Scams are all the time, and, and the problem is the dishonest people are way ahead of the game. So they've already figured out ways to do it, especially taking advantage of seniors, uh, taking advantage of young people. A new round of emails popping up this week from scammers warning that if you don't provide your personal information, like your social security number, your home address, you may not get that second check. These are clearly scams. There really should be no reason to enter your social security number. There's certain things that you just don't need to put online. And to be clear, no decision yet regarding the possibility of a second stimulus check. And if you've not received the first one, the IRS website is the only official site providing you with updates. I believe as a country, we will see another stimulus only because of the fact people are still hurting. Uh, this was nobody's doing. This was nobody's fault. So I think what we have to do is, is keep people at least motivated and moving a little bit forward. Otherwise, I don't even want to think about what it would be like to try to climb out of it. All right. We appreciate that, Hank. Well, a reminder about our community-wide effort to help frontline workers and local restaurants. It's food for free.